welcome. This is Melissa Arma with the Stock Swoosh. Happy July 4th, everyone. I'm going over Apple. This was an options trade that I called in the options newsletter. I called the 190 calls. I felt like this took forever to go. What do I mean? It didn't go until the last day. <laughs> it ended up being a very profitable trade today. But, I, you know, one of the reasons people always ask me, how do you manage options trades? Well, for me, okay, the risk, the stop is the risk. So the stop is the risk. So I don't put in an extra stop. Now, if you want to kill a trade, if it's down 50%, okay, you could kill it, but then you may miss out on a trade like this. So this trade popped today. Again, flew up, gapped up today, ran up. It expires today, July, June 30th. We didn't take it into July. No one should be still in this actually <laughs> um but i mean if you stayed with this trade you got paid so in this type of market i really think patience is key besides making the right picks and we went long you know this was a long it's not always that i go long but apple is a strong chart now again we're tapering off here it's friday almost 12 o'clock eastern time going into holiday weekend everyone should be flat no one should be in any trades here um, no one should be trading the rest of the day. The day is over and I actually closed the trading room today because I thought today would be very low volume. We had a move this morning, but everybody really should be done and out. But here is the chart of Apple, as you well can see. So again, I called the 190 calls, but it took up until the last day, the last day to go. And sometimes that's what it is. So one of, the, one of the pieces of advice I give to people is don't risk more than you can afford to lose because then you will be more calm and peaceful waiting the trade out. This started to lift. You know, it started to lift though this week. I mean, it started to lift here and started to lift here. Depending what you paid for it, you might've been able to get out of it yesterday with some money. In fact, I was really just break even yesterday. I must've paid more than some with this, but it popped today. And this is also one of the benefits of being on the options newsletter. Why? Because I will call a trade. Then it will gap in the direction of the move. In a call, it would gap up like this. This gapped up over the strike. And sometimes I call puts that gap down through the strike. These are the most profitable trades of all the trades that I ever call on the options newsletter is when you are in a trade and the move happens overnight and you're already in it. You don't have to do anything. You don't have to do anything with this today. You could have got out of it today not even thought and you were up but again you would have had to hold it so this is part of the learning process so many people don't want to take the time to learn if you understand this chart and why i called the trade you would have been fine with holding it through and taking your time with it if you don't understand you don't understand so it's important to understand this closed here at 189.59 gapped up open in the morning at 190.163 high today was 193.15 Again, if it was not a holiday, if we weren't going to into a short week, I would say this could have gone to 195 today. I mean, I don't think that happens, but again, if this was a normal Friday, a normal day, I might have said that. Now, if you're thinking about trading options with me, the best thing you can do is first take the Golden Gap course, but I know a lot of people just don't wanna take the time to learn. That is your choice. I think you will trade better if you actually learn the system. And if you do, um, you're gonna, again, stay with a trade like this, which was a fabulous trade, a gorgeous trade. Beautiful. It's like 175% return on investment in this trade. So this was really a nice winner and a wonderful surprise here going into the holiday weekend. If you just wanna sign up for the Gap Options newsletter, you can, you can, there are no prerequisites for that. I have a six month subscription and a 12 month subscription. Email me at melissa at thestockswoosh.com if you'd like more information and have a great holiday weekend, everyone.